Well, when I, when I started uh, out in university, I was very interested in demographics and the population question. I still am. Um, back then, there was uh, a s global scare, at least among certain um, uh, quarters of describers and deciders, uh, that we were going to uh, head into a uh, human calamity caused by heedless breeding of, they wouldn't put it this way, but of the lower orders, which is really, there was a eugenic uh, smell to a lot of this, even for the left uh, wingers and uh, the statists who were interested in uh, controlling the growth of human population. And, uh, I mean, even when I was a leftist, I thought there was something horribly offensive about this. Um, uh, uh, the bien pensants knew better uh, how many children people uh, should have than they did. They really knew better. Um, I think that the experience of the last almost half century um, has been a sort of a natural experiment. And we kind of see the answer at this point. Um, the world's population has, well, let's say, doubled, probably more than doubled. Um, since the beginning of the 1900s, per capita incomes around the world have maybe risen by a factor of 600 uh, percent. They're still going up. Uh, measured uh, absolute poverty may not be measured perfectly, but it's plummeted. Um, life expectancy more or less everywhere uh, has surged. Uh, Educational attainment has surged. Uh, personal wealth has surged. Despite the current inflation, the long-term real prices of food have gone down uh, substantially. Uh, and we know now, I think, that uh, the real essence of uh, wealth of nations is in human beings. I mean, you can augment their capabilities and their potential. You can encourage that through um, education and nutrition and upbringing and so forth. Uh, you can unlock the value in human beings by having a more auspicious business climate. Um, but it's the wealth is in human beings. It's not in the ground. It's not in the oil wells. It's not in the timber. Uh, and we're seeing, um, we're seeing an escape from poverty, which is based upon uh, human creativity, human knowledge, the creation of human knowledge, and then the application of human knowledge. So it's a... Uh, it's a remarkable, uh, it's a remarkable human and humanistic achievement. Uh, and appreciating the reasons for the escape from poverty, uh, I think, would, would be a great cautionary for much of the, um, much of the uh, inescapable and always returning statist impulses that one uh, has to contend with now and probably in the future.